Hey water signs, welcome back to Pure Black Magic. Emphasis on the pure, the black, and the magic. If you guys are new here, my name is Dee. Thank you guys for taking the time to check out the channel. Hopefully you like the vibe, you like the content, you decide to hit that subscribe button. If you are returning, super, super thank you to all of you for all of your continued love and support of the channel, you guys. It is greatly appreciated. This is going to be a pop-up message, pop-up love reading, okay? So for my water signs, um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, this is for you. All right. It is very general. So please keep that in mind that it's not going to resonate with everyone. Um, also you guys, I will be doing a lot more just random pop-up messages. So be sure that you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure that you hit that notification bell. So you are aware of when new content is uploaded. Okay. So we're going to see what we have come out from the spiritual is fuck that for you guys. Okay. Um, also the more you interact with the content here, the more, um, it'll put your energy into these readings. So be sure that you are liking, subscribing, commenting, talk to me. I talk back. I don't bite. Okay. So we have thou shall not judge because thou has fucked up before too. Okay. So these are messages between you and your partner, whoever you are engaged with thinking about at this time. Um, so maybe your partner or, you know, situation, whoever this is for you, maybe they fucked up. Maybe they made a mistake. Um, maybe you guys are trying to get past something here. We also have, it's up to you to find beauty in the ugliest day. So, yes, yeah, so I feel like you're, you're very optimistic. Maybe someone is being hard on, the, on themselves in regards to you or this connection. Maybe somebody's nervous or they feel like they can't please you or, or, um, amount up to your level or something like that. And I feel like you're being very, um, you're being very like, easy on this person you're being, being very nurturing okay well welcoming is what i want to say but you are a water sign so that is your energy the next card out is you don't have to rebuild a relationship with everyone you have forgiven okay so i don't know maybe you're letting someone down easy um whoever this is for you or maybe um you're trying to tell your person this or they're trying to tell you this okay so maybe somebody fucked up because they involved in like an ex or ex fling or ex partner um and you are just telling them like you don't have to rebuild the relationship or stay um in contact with somebody from their past that's what i'm getting okay so i don't know it could have been like a third party but i don't feel like it was major i feel like it was something that was kind of minor something you guys can talk through work through and get over um get past should i say it says grab life by the balls and make it your bitch okay so taking control over situation um and then it has holding on to resentment is like taking a shit in your own heart the earth signs just had this message so you could be dealing with a earth sign a taurus virgo a capricorn and at the bottom of the deck this card is looking at me it says prayer is dope as fuck okay so maybe you're very spiritual or your person is very spiritual or you pray over this connection or for this person um but i feel like you guys are very in tune it says to thine own ass be true behind that okay so i don't know maybe your person has i don't know they're feeling guilty about an ex or someone they left behind or there's some sort of weird energy like that but we are going to get into the energy cards okay it's going to be a quick pop-up love message for my water signs i just saw the community card i'm hearing that you are the only person for this person for your person okay all eyes on you they don't want you thinking that anyone else is competition okay whether you're feminine or masculine anxiety they're very anxious about this okay they view you as very um valuable very established um almost a little bit intimidated by you okay so let's see water signs what do we have between you and your love interest your person whoever you're thinking about here what messages spirit do we have for my water signs? Damn. Okay, so um, the earth signs also just had this card pop out first, the seven chakra, the crown chakra. Okay, this was also the first card to pop out in the collective message that I uploaded today. So if you resonate with this, you probably resonate with that. You probably resonate with the earth sign reading or you have it highly aspected in your chart. Second chakra popped out right after that. So I kind of feel like alignment, you guys are working on getting in, in alignment, okay? So maybe this is a situation ship. Maybe it's not super serious yet, or maybe you guys, you know, are rebuilding or reconciling. Maybe it was super serious at a point in time, um, and you're working on understanding each other a lot better. And then we have the broken heart card here, okay? So this broken heart is actually uh, mended back together, all right? So... 
at the bottom of the deck, we have healer of the ages. All right. So somebody is really, um, I feel like you're all someone, you are all someone can think about or you them really wanting to, what's after this broken heart card? The envy and the angel of love. Okay. Kind of similar. This is very similar to the earth sign. So definitely check that out. Um, but maybe you're really wanting to heal a situation here. Okay. I feel like you are the healer in this situation or somebody views you as being very, again, nurturing, healing, um, I don't know, like you giving them the benefit of the doubt. You kind of unconditional love is kind of what I'm getting here or just an unconditional friendship or whatever this is. Um, I feel like you kind of like give this person a vibe or energy that they've never given to anyone else. OK, but you're just naturally um, a good person, naturally just nurturing. OK, naturally care for this person. OK, water sign. So let's see. You're wanting to heal a connection. Or maybe somebody's broken, okay? Maybe your partner or you are going through something else outside of this relationship and you're trying to help them get through it. What messages do we have for my water signs, Spirit, for this pop-up love reading? Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio, okay? Ooh, Queen of Cups. You're showing up right in your own reading. Queen of Cups, okay? Cancer energy, Pisces, Scorpio energy here. That very loving, nurturing, motherly type of energy here, okay? So I feel like you're just like mentally and emotionally very grounded. You're very stable um, or you're very stable in this person's life, okay? What else do we have? The Sun card, y'all, okay? What's next, Spirit? The Page of Pentacles, you bring the sun to this person. Um, you bring happiness and joy in the sun to this person's life here. Okay. Also, you could, um, something is being brought to light here or illuminated. You help this individual see something here or realize something about themselves or this connection or life in general. We have the page of pentacles and then we have the knight of swords and then we have the two of cups. All right. So look at this, Page of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, and Two of Cups. What did I just say? I said you you make this person see something differently. You change their perspective on love and relationships, okay? Um, you like make them want to be a better person or they're so attracted to you or magnetized to you. Whatever you are, naturally your light is like influencing this person to do it's like they're moving out of this page of pentacles energy okay into a night from a page to a night so they're stepping up fast movement here and then the two of cups somebody wants to hold on to you and not let go okay and then again like i said we had the the queen of cups here and the um and the sun card okay so wow okay this is your energy or this is um your person's energy and then even at the bottom of the deck y'all we got the six of wands this is a card of victory okay this is a, a card of a certain position um people respecting you people admiring you people feeling like you have some sort of gift or knowledge or like people just like lining up for you like this person thinks so highly of you okay eight of wands they could be communicating that I was just about to mention the three of cups, okay? So we have the two of cups and the queen of cups, was, which gives you the three of cups energy, all right? That's reconciliation, that's celebration, that's coming together. Behind the six of wands and the eight of wands, a lot of passion here, okay? A lot of fire and emotions for you. We do have the three of cups, okay? So somebody's coming in and wants to communicate. I feel like somebody just wants like... They feel like they're that you're their soulmate. They've never been with a person like you. They are mesmerized by you, okay? Seven of Cups right behind that. So they are definitely in their heads about you, okay? Queen of Swords and the Empress. I feel like you don't take any shit. I feel like you are very on top of your game. You have boundaries. Um, you're very abundant, okay? You could be the mother of their child or they just, I don't know, somebody, somebody stuck on you, okay? So let's see. Firm foundation at the bottom of the Psychic Oracle deck. Foundation and achievements when I split the deck. Four and four. Look at this. Firm foundation. Somebody wants to have and start a firm foundation with you. Foundation and achievements. They also want to achieve things with you. They want to grow. Okay. They want a house. They want a family. They want love and marriage. Four and four. The number 44 could be significant. That's confirmation for someone. Okay. Or the month of April. Um, the number eight, all right, it's also what I'm hearing. Somebody's name is April as well, so that could be you or your significant other. 
Um, let's see what the Psychic Oracle deck has to say, Water Signs. I'm, ex I'm excited for you. I'm excited for this connection. I don't know. Let's see. What messages? What is the seven chakra for my water signs? Ooh, intuition. Very intuitive. What did I say? A lot of you guys are light workers, okay? You could have um, psychic abilities. It's just like you have an inner knowing, like you know how to navigate through life. You know how to lead people. Your light just kind of shines on its own and it looks very effortlessly, okay? Water signs are connected to the moon, especially cancer. So you could um, just be very in, can very in cancer, very intuitive, Um I feel like you balance this person out. You could have moon. Your moon could be in cancer as well. But the intuition card with this knowledge that you have, okay? I feel like you just have it all. Like, I don't even... This person is just... They can't believe that you are you or they have a chance with someone like you, okay? Um, hope, okay? Yeah, you give this person hope, okay? You give this person this person hope to be better um in their life overall okay i feel like you've just sparked some sort of inspiration in this person and then we have balance here okay very similar to the earth sign reading okay what did i just say you balance them got you balance them guys you balance this person out um or them you and then foundation and achievements right at the bottom of the deck again okay so very positive um i don't know i kind of want to know who this this water sign is because i'm impressed but i'm gonna leave it here go ahead and like share and subscribe to the channel you guys if this is your message please leave me a comment below letting me know how don't forget to um yeah like share and subscribe see you next time